Namaste, I'm Dr. Shreya Shah. I'm a consultant at uh, Center for Sight for cornea, cataract and refractive surgery. Imagine your eye to be something like a camera where the natural lens inside is similar to the condensing lens of a camera. Light passes through the eye, through the lens and those rays get condensed to a single point focus on the retina which then send signals to the brain and that's how you see. Through life, this natural lens is transparent which allows you to see clearly. However, with age, that natural lens starts getting opaque, it starts getting cloudy and becomes white. That is known as a cataract. You may experience cloudy vision, blurry vision, Difficulty in viewing objects at night, increased glare with an ongoing uh, bright light. Uh, colors may appear duller than usual. So as of now, surgical treatment is the only proven treatment for cataract. What we do in cataract surgery is essentially remove that cataractus lens by different techniques and then replace it with a clear artificial lens which is known as an intraocular lens, so that you are able to see clearly. There are many, many techniques that have evolved over the years, but what we use and what is widely done now is something known as phaco emulsification. It is an ultrasound method in which, by way of an instrument, the cataract is emulsified and it is taken out by the machine itself through a very small incision anywhere between 2.2 to 2.8 millimeters in size. We also have another technique known as femtocataract surgery, wherein a separate machine, also known as a femtolaser machine, does the bit of making the incisions and helping out and doing a few steps in the surgery by way of laser and that improves the precision by which the surgery is done. The rest of the surgery is then completed by phaco emulsification. Once the cataractus lens is removed, it is replaced by an artificial lens which is also called as an intraocular lens or an eye well. There are various kinds of lenses that are available, uh, different kinds of technologies that are available and the choice of the lens depends on the nature of the cataract, it depends on the condition of the patient's eye and there are a host of factors that need to be taken into consideration when we plan the choice of lens that is used. Briefly, uh, there are three to four types of lenses that are available. The first category is called a monofocal lens, which means that it allows for clear, crisp vision for distance viewing. However, one will require glasses for near work or for reading or even work at an intermediate distance for example using the computer or a laptop. The second type of lens is known as a bifocal lens or a multifocal lens where vision is good for distance viewing as well as for reading. The newer generation lens, uh, one step ahead of that is called as a trifocal lens where your vision is good for distance, intermediate and near vision. So this closely mimics your natural vision. Newer category of lenses that are available are called EDOF lenses or also known as extended depth of focus lenses. These lenses offer good distance and intermediate vision. However, near vision might require assistance with the help of spectacles. However, it is important to note that not every lens is suitable for you. Uh, your doctor has to make and discuss your lifestyle, check your entire eye. There are a host of conditions which may hinder the use of one particular lens or the other. So just because a lens is new or the technology is new doesn't mean it is necessarily the best for you. Follow Center for Sight and post your queries to get answers from the experts.